Keeping it moving, man. Staying busy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I see you dropped another mountain god. The third one. This is the crazy thing, though. Like, so, it was, the third one came about, like, really quick. <laughs> because the first two were, I would say, carefully planned. Um, it was getting near the end of the year. And um, and I was like, all right, took over the studio two and a half months ago. Um, I was working for uh, for the previous owner, Tom, for 18 years. And then um, and then, you know, he's been wanting to retire. COVID delayed everything. And so because he was wanting to retire four years ago. And, um, and then we got the deal done two and a half months ago. And so and so um, and saying all that. I was been here a few months and I was like, I need to record. Right. And, um, and so it was on December 1st, after I got done looking at a bunch of people giving reviews and talking about album of the years, some deserving, some not. And I ain't even saying as a hater, you know, like, mm -hmm. um, I was like, you know what? I'm going to get in the booth. So I hit up my graphics guy that did the other two Mountain God covers on December 4th and said, I'm going in the booth. So then five days later, I have Mountain God 3. <laughs> <laughs> I went in the booth and recorded and recorded that in two days. And then it got to it got to the release day. And I still felt like it was missing something seven hours before the release. So then that's when I got in and I recorded Merciless.